if I can sum it up, uh, learn to listen to your body. Knowing how your body responds to things is, is key. Knowing what, uh, what your numbers are. You know, have some blood work done so you can see, okay, my testosterone levels are here, my thyroids are here, my inflammation levels, you know, are they high? Um, I, was, I wasn't pre-diabetic, but I was, you know, probably, like Dr. Shaw said, if I kept living the way I was living 10 or 15 years, I could certainly be diabetic because my A1C was like 5.7 or something. I think 7 uh, is, is like when you become pre-diabetic, and, and I didn't want to be a diabetic. Um, it's, a, it's a tough lifestyle. I wouldn't say it really struck fear in me, but it really kind of made me wake up and think to myself, you know, what am I going to do to change all this? And then uh, start to pr pr pursue some avenues that can, can change it. And for me, it was, it was going on the, the, the ketogenic uh, lifestyle. It was losing the bread, losing the sugars, uh, quit all the sodas and soft drinks. Um, I love the little Debbie. Swiss rolls, especially in the freezer, they're fantastic. I still have them, but it's it's very rare, maybe one a week, like on a Saturday evening. Um, I have one kind of as a reward. But uh, the way that I feel on this with this new lifestyle is, is just amazing. I mean, I, I, uh, I have tons of energy now. I don't do energy drinks like I used to. You know, I used to drink um, one at, at the minimum, uh, sometimes two and even three a day, just to kind of get through the day. Not to mention two cups of coffee in the morning and even cups of coffee in the afternoon. So it felt like I was constantly searching out caffeine or taurine or one of the stimulants to kind of get me through the day. And, and I haven't had, I haven't had a soda, I haven't had a monster, uh, which was my choice of energy drink and, and amp. Um, I haven't had any of those things. I still drink coffee because I love coffee, but I only have one cup a day now. It's in the mornings. Um, but I haven't pursued any of those things in um, five months now. I've been, I've been seeing Dr. Shaw for six months. Um, so that's no longer even part of my life. And I feel a lot better without the energy drinks because I have the energy that I need uh, now. And again, it's just from uh, going through the, the ketogenic lifestyle and lowering my my carb intake and increasing my fat intake, keeping my calories around 2,000, my uh, net carbs are 25 or 30 net carbs a day, protein's about 120 grams a day, and then my fat content's about 160 grams a day. I got this really cool app called Senza, S-E-N-Z-A, that I use uh, that tracks my food every day. So I, you can just scan a barcode on a product and it'll put right in there what it is. Uh, and so I use that to kind of see where my numbers are. So when I first when I first came to see Dr. Shaw and he, he talked about my belly fat and losing some weight, you know, I, I didn't know what I weighed, but I uh, prior to coming in, so I wasn't really tracking it. Um, but when I stepped on the scale in his office, I was 259 pounds. Um, today, I'm 233 pounds, you know, which is, it's only been like five months, um, and I feel fantastic.